Welcome back friends, followers and transients to City Skylines with me, Vapor. And I think, <laughs> for me anyway, i built a little bit of a masterpiece here. However, the amount of traffic that's trying to channel through it, it's just not going very well. Um, considering what I had here before, I think this is a million times better. And I based it off of um, kind of what we have over in the UK. You wouldn't necessarily have a round kind of curvy road here. Sometimes it'd just be straight across, but we tend to have roundabouts built um, over the freeway or the motorway or whatever you want to call it. And the, tr the uh, terrain tends to kind of raise up around these points and go back down. Um, the only difference is there would probably be, it's not always, sometimes it's like this, there would be a little wall along the side here. Occasionally it's all concrete. Um, but it'd probably be a kind of smoothened out a little bit and have some trees and it kind of really depends so um, if I really want to get into the decorating side of it then I, I can probably do that I have downloaded various bits and pieces um, just to kind of get used to stuff um, so I was I was working on some kind of uh, bollard I think or a retaining wall or whatever down the middle here using a prop line tool and um, it went reasonably well it's going to take some getting used to I think but um, yeah not too bad I'm just like literally shocked <laughs> by how much traffic is passing through here and I don't know if it, I mean even if it was um, a slightly wider road would it make a difference I wonder with more lanes hmm I guess we're gonna have to try that out okay as you can see we have um, 54,000 credits whatever um, I guess that's pretty much because I've let the game run a little bit um, because I needed to because <laughs> I just didn't have the money to, to do a whole lot over there the terraforming does cost an absolute fortune I'm just having a quick look around here okay so New George is getting close to another milestone so um, a couple of questions <laughs> Jeez. Um, no, number one is there a way to stop fires? Because there have been so many fires around here, it's crazy. I know there's a mud out there that turns the fires off. But, like, just natural disasters in general are so annoying. I mean, it's only been forest fires so far, but... It just kind of... I don't know. It, it's not causing me any issue. I have fire trucks there dealing with it, but I don't know if it detracts from the gameplay a little bit. Um, but I was just thinking about this road. If I upgrade it to another one, I think it might actually put traffic lights on it. So, but we'll give it a go and see what happens. May or may not. Has it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, so this is going to potentially back things up a little bit more. Let's, let's do that and see. All the vehicles kind of get back into... Uh, have I done that the wrong way around? You see, I'd like this to all be one way, and I can't do that yet, which is really annoying. One of these is probably one way, unless you can't do one way. Four lane, four lane, decorative ground. Maybe you can't. How annoying. There's six lane, but that's going to be fairly big, isn't it? Let me let me try that. That's just, you know, costing me a small fortune here. So that gives more lanes. Again, is that traffic lights? Hmm. The traffic lights are going to be the problem here. This is why I tend not to like using these. See, I don't mind this too much here. That's not so bad. I could probably mess around with various settings here with the traffic lights. These junctions are very close to each other. Um, if you were coming around here, the odds are you'd want to be turning here. So, if we say you are here, you need to move here. Is that right? Would that be right? I'm hoping so. Yeah. Because then we can do something with this lane, surely. What have we got here? Clear traffic. Okay, why are you all piling into there? I thought I switched that off. Don't worry, we're not going to have an entire episode of me trying to figure this out. That's not what I'm going to do. I thought that would have been enough. You, maybe if we put you there. 
or there. Because what I want to do is turn the traffic lights off here, so this lane can keep into this side here. And then I suppose if we change, it's this one, isn't it? If we go into here, so we want this lane. No, that one's fine. So that's going to be, can't see because of the truck. There we go. So that'll be, so we're going to replicate that on the next lane across. So it should be two reds. There we go. So if I'm right in thinking, if I've done this right, what can I do with this? As long as they stay in that lane and nobody tries to sneak in here. Not that it'll make a difference because I think pretty much what will happen. Manual traffic lights, switch traffic lights. Is there a way of turning them off? Maybe I need to get the mod that takes them away. Add or remove traffic lights. Oh, here we go. So it now has no traffic lights there. Are they giveaway signs? Let me have a quick look. Can't tell. But I'm hoping, and we can probably turn the ones off here as well, let's see. I'm hoping that deals with the issues. There we go, the traffic is flowing. We could probably, with a bit of work, turn most of these off. Just by tweaking which lanes people are using. So, I guess if we come into here, you're all going that way. Which, again, if maybe, no, it's this one, isn't it? If we change this one here to be right only, as I get comfortable, <laughs> that, that should deal with that problem. You're going to go straight on, okay. So we can probably do something similar here. Did I take the traffic lights away from that? No. Let me take them away a second. There we are. So... You want to go that way, so we need to mess with you to say you go there, I suppose. It's essentially going to become a bit of a null sort of lane. Like, nobody really should be using it. If, if I'm kind of looking at that right. So if you're here, you need to go to there. I mean, actually, I could probably ignore that one, couldn't I? This is right click there. Done that right? No. So do we click there again? There we go. Let's see what happens now. So they're automatically moving across, which is perfect. Which should allow these guys to pull out, I'm hoping. I mean if I wanted to give them a little bit more room, I could make them use a slightly different Whoa, that sudden jerk that they do. Uh, yeah. This is what happens when I start playing around with stuff. The other option is, and I don't know if this works, let me, bear with me one second. We're going to go and do something else right after this. I didn't mean to do that. Just want to have, oh, come on now. Ah. Look you into here. Let's not turn that off. I thought it did. All right, you're switched off. You are switched off. What happens if I click on here? What happens if I do that? Does anyone then use that lane? Well, in fact, let's test it out. Let's take two lanes away. Interesting. They're still using that lane, even though I've done that. Is it too confusing for them, maybe? And then they're swinging across the last thing here because, yeah, because they want to do that. That makes sense. I'd almost want traffic here if it's going around to kind of pull out on the further lane. Yeah, but it seems to be it seems to be working fine. We'll we'll leave that on. But let's not let's not confuse people. I'll just take the traffic lights away. Just to keep it flowing. Still a lot going on up here. What is slowing them down? Maybe when something comes around here. Do we need... Yes, we do need this. So when this vehicle comes... I don't know, it's still flowing. I could do this as a six lane as well, but that's just going to confuse stuff even more. There's just so much coming. Look at all these vehicles. Oh my god. 
I think it's because it's the only way in and out of here. Okay, any suggestions on how to make that better? I think this is fairly good. I could change this to a two-lane, one-way road instead of an on-ramp. But that's not really going to help much. It's more the amount of traffic literally trying to get out of here. I mean, if we... Uh, this is the sixth lane. Yeah. What would happen, for argument's sake? It's going to put traffic lights here. I know that much. So it gives a couple more lanes to play with. Oh, does it not put traffic? No, it doesn't. Okay. Is that going to help? It might. I don't, and this is the other thing as well. A lot of roundabouts like this in, in this country do not have traffic lights. Some of the bigger ones, because this is quite wide now, um, they, uh, they would. Sometimes only part-time, so they're not always on. Um, but in general, you have to kind of watch what's coming around before you pull out. Anyway, as far as I'm concerned, that is working. There is a little bit of traffic there. Um, you've got to bear in mind we do have people coming in here as well because there's no public transport. There's something we'll have to work on later on. Uh, let's switch this on. Landfill. My God, we're going through um, garbage like there's no tomorrow. Okay, so there's still more of a need f for jobs, I guess. Um, we're going to ignore that for the moment. What I wanted to do, because people were talking about having commercial over here. So I've got this little bit here which I don't want. So I'm, I'm thinking of putting a little bit of commercial in here. We'll have some kind of parks and stuff along here and just have a bit of commercial that they can get to away from that roundabout. This is another one that I need to kind of mess around with at some point. But I'm not going to do it right now. I think where I'm kind of... Uh, I'm going to use the word frustrated is because I'm trying to play the game properly. Where I'm trying to run a city and earn the money. It kind of slows me down because when I'm looking at this, I could I could time lapse tinkering around, putting stuff in here, making this look good. But because I'm working with limited money, I can't do that. Like terraforming, doing this cost me a fortune, and I had to. I've probably been sat here for a good hour waiting for the money to come back. Um, and I understand the bigger the city is, the more money will gain, but uh, also at the same time, the more the more it's going to cost me within services. So I don't know. I mean, part of me wanted to play with with money off. So I could just do what I want, but it doesn't matter. I'm fine. We'll uh, we'll, we'll crack on with it and hopefully do something decent. Right, so we're going to go with... We do have public transport now, don't we? We have some stuff. What are this? Yeah, biofuel bus depot. Okay. We have biofuel over here. Well, not, I don't think it's bio. I think it's uh, like dual fuel. Trams. So it's like is it hydrogen and petrol or something like that. I can't... I can't quite remember, to be honest. Um, so this is going to be more of a smaller shopping area. So let's go with the, uh, the single lane road. Where would we come off from? So we're going to have some public paths. You could send a road through there, but I don't want trucks come bellowing through here. Maybe if. That's taking power to there, isn't it? There's nothing. Okay, let's, let's chuck you to here for a second. Which will allow me to take you out. Awesome. I think we'll come through here. I didn't need to do that anyway, because it'll just rebuild instantly, probably. So if we come straight down off there... Yeah, you can be upset. All you want. Let's say... Because I need to keep a little bit of distance because of noise. Let's go to about maybe halfway-ish. Then we'll run a line across. We'll keep this a little bit more straight. And I think if we... You can't build a park off a public highway, can you? I don't think you can. So if we bring you to about here, we can put the pathway through there to that. That would be quite good. Let's have a look at the parks. Where are they now? I completely have no clue. Here they go. Ooh. Nice. Botanical gardens. Oh, yeah, there's loads of stuff. You see, I've been downloading various <laughs> bits and pieces. I forgot about these. Got loads and loads of stuff. Yeah, let's, let's not get distracted. And we got some grass. I've not got around to trying this stuff out yet. But when the uh, when the time comes, we will be there. I didn't download many parks, so we're going to have very basic stuff right now. Uh, what does that look like? Can we have two of those? I know they're the same. Yeah, I like that. That's good. And the pathway comes under the other one, doesn't it? Yep, there it is. 
So we go with you. I think if we go with the free form tool, we'll come through here. No, I've not done that right. You've got to click next to it, haven't you? There we go. Can we... There is a pathway there, isn't there? Does that connect? No. Well, you suck. I thought it might have done. Come on. Can I tweak this with the move it tool? I can. Awesome. The tool that I think is very powerful, but I always seem to break everything when I do it. So that will give us a little bit of... We could do with a, a zebra cross in there, or a, a pedestrian crossing, whatever you want to call it. And then we could probably get another one coming through here. But it does, it does kind of sort of need... We'll probably run that along the back here. Um, probably free form tool. Maybe we can go with um, something like this. Actually, let's let's give ourselves a little bit more room. So I think we can do something quite nice. Okay, am I in the wrong tool? It's not quite doing what I want it to do. Probably because I'm a noob. Bear with me. Oh, you can connect to these. That did connect, so why wouldn't... Ah, the, the connection is here. So if we... There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. Can I come through here? No. What about... Without taking this person's home out? Probably not. Ah. Now I like that. The only thing you say that I don't like too much is... This kind of weirdness that it does. But we have this tool here, I believe. Does that take out... Is that taking my road away? Well, that sucks. That doesn't kind of work how you'd expect it. I can probably do something with that later on anyway. Okay, so that's going to give a little bit of happiness as well. We can probably run another path off that direction too. I really I really hope you're liking in what, what I'm kind of doing here. Because, I mean, I don't necessarily mean <laughs> this specific thing, but just in general. Because I don't know really what people expect of me when I play this game. Because a lot of people know that I like to, to build decorative sort of things. And I'm not really doing that here. I mean, I'm trying to a degree. Do we have a different path that looks like that? Is that the dirt one? I think it is, isn't it? That's that. I think it's just where the texture's slightly different. What well, it is. That probably looks a little bit better, if I'm honest. It looks kind of more in keeping with what we're doing. Yeah. I think I, think I can... I can live with that a little bit better. Perfect. So, so we've got minus 14. People are moving out. I'm putting parks in and people are not happy. Who knew? I uh, do have water here, kind of. Run you over there. And you here. Awesome. So we're going to go with some commercial. I think parks along here. Yeah, I think the, com the commercial can come in here. Like so. Does it have power? Very close to having power, not quite. Do we have any smaller parks, I wonder? Um, what are you? Plaza with trees. Ooh. That would look really nice if it was more centered with there. Ugh. Uh, basketball court. There's something. Something that would look good here. And that is that the same thing that I've just used? Quite possibly. I guess we're going to have to do this the old-fashioned way until... Oh no, there we go. It's got power. So that's going to give me a little bit more commercial. Um, houses, we're not going to put any more along there. But I guess we can move the commercial that's over here. And have this as houses. And they've got the, uh, the trucks have got a straight run in at the moment. So they won't be going through the... Uh, the commercial area. Some car parks might be a good idea. I think I have some. I think I downloaded them. Maybe not. 
Are they called parking lots or something? That's probably probably what it is. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, uh, this is the problem when you're all from different countries. Everyone names things differently. Uh, we've got something a little bit more. And I, I think I can make my own versions of these anyway. Yikes, you're humongous. So are you. We don't need anything that big. We have the decals. How big is that? Um, how does that actually look? So this is a functional parking lot as well, which is quite useful. Um, is it T to copy? Aha, uh -huh, it is. Cool. See, I'm get, <laughs> getting the hang of everything now. We could put some nice trees. I think I have some... Um, here we go. Let's have a go at the prop line tool. Uh, is it a wall or a bush? That's a good question. I think it's a wall. I know what I'm looking for. It's green. <laughs> and it's a wall. Well, la, 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 la. Somewhere in here. Do you know what? I think there's an easier way of doing this. What are you? Your ground tiles. It's one of these. It's just going to be trees, isn't it? Water structures, disasters, billboards, special billboards, industrial. What are you? Wow, I downloaded all sorts of stuff, so I'm a little bit kind of unsure what I've got. These are because I know I'm going to decorate at some point, so they're at least here ready to go. Uh, what are you? Parks. Ah, is that what I'm looking for? Could it be? Probably more that one. Yeah, we got all sorts of stuff. So much variety. This is the thing I love about this game, and also hate at the same time. There's um, there's so many things. <laughs> to use. We could probably use these. Let's have a look. Now let's see if I can figure this prop line tool thing out. Okay, that does that. So what else can we do? The spacing is oh, mm, what we're using here. Spacing wise control. Item wise control. What does that do? Does it make a difference? Yeah, I don't like that. So how do I get those a little bit closer? I guess change this. So if I put that to 7. Ah. 6.5. Oh, they don't kind of overlap how I'd expect them to. What about 5? What was it? What does that actually do? Oh, that's changing that, I see. Default... Hmm. Plus one, minus. I thought they would have blended in with each other, but I guess not. It's probably too much to ask. Oh, that looks terrible. Okay, let's try it just like that. Let's see if we can uh, actually achieve this. Oh, they're all wonky. Why is that? Are they wonky? It looks a little bit wonky to me. Yeah, slightly, isn't it? That one there. I wonder why. Can we... Oh, wow. I thought the prop line tool was supposed to keep them in a the line. We'll go with it for a moment, just while, we, uh, while we're trying stuff out. Can we just do a single one of these? Yeah, that's too big. Oh, we had a longer one after all that. Okay, let's, let's try this again. Lots of trial and error. So if we rotate you... I just want to try this by hand without the prop line tool. Ah, I thought that if we placed them right on top of each other, they would blend in nicely, but... What about if we... Do something like that. We can plant a tree or something in there, can't we? Just to... That's kind of nice, but it's not going to work. And neither's that. This is where we use the smaller one, I guess, isn't it? So if we can kind of keep it looking very similar. And I think I can copy these if I highlight them. Don't quote me on that. 
Now, ooh, I'm sure I can raise and lower these things. I, I don't know. I have no clue whatsoever. Because they don't feel like they're on the same level, which is entirely possible. I bet, I bet people are pulling their hair out watching this, you know. Come on, play nicely. There we go. So if we place you about there. We'll do the same sort of thing, which is like that. And hopefully... We get a similar thing going on. My god, this is stressful. <laughs> right, let's try it. So if I... Switch to that. Okay, we don't want don't want nodes, don't want segments, don't want trees. Are they? Don't they, I think these are cla are they classed as props? No, is it a building? No. What is it then? Weird. Ah. Right there we go. And is, is it? Uh, it's T, isn't it? Doesn't work that way. Can I not do it that way? Oh, come on. Um, con control C. <gasps> Magic. Oh wow. I do love it. Okay, that needs to be somewhere kind of around there, I suppose. Do I just delete that now? Escape. Yep. And then these. <laughs> Oop. We don't want that. How do I cancel that? Is it right click? Yep. If we move you guys... Oh, this car's appearing out of nowhere. Yeah, this is definitely going to end up being time-lapse, because you can imagine what I'm going to be like if I'm doing this. I will take an absolute age messing around with things. I'm still going to get used to how it all works. I'm slowly but surely getting there, but... I still feel like I've got so much to learn. I don't even think I've got that many trees. There is some trees and grass and various things that I've downloaded. I mean, that's quite a nice one we got. What we got here? Summer tree. Ooh. What else have we got? What are the goodies? Lots of grass. Some of this looks like ridiculously big though. Like, <laughs> it just looks really odd. I suppose once you kind of put it all down and add different things to it, it probably looks quite good. Uh, what do we? Get? Ah, that's what I was looking for earlier. Finally found it. I we got some lamps so we could put some extra lighting in here if we needed it. Let's see. What we that actually might be the ticket. But it looks a little bit odd. Small bush. You're massive. Um, so are you. Wow. The, the the options. And to think, I've not really actually got, <laughs> got into the workshop fully yet. What's it going to be like once I start downloading millions of props? Let's go with you, because it kind of seems similar to the trees we got around here. Are these just all going to be the same size? Oh, no, no. There is different ones. I wasn't sure, just because um, I haven't got the rotating tree mod, so it doesn't. And some trees, I guess, would be the same. <laughs> it doesn't look too bad. Not not bad for a, a first attempt. And we're making tons of money as well, which means I can do stuff to my heart's content. I guess don't have to worry too much about the uh, about building whatever I want because the, the money's not really a problem. I would like the incinerators. We're probably going to have to expand our population a little bit. Let's have a look at night. Let's have a look down here. Switch to this camera. There we go. Doesn't look too bad. It, it looks it looks believable. There's lots of light in this parking area. It's a bit dark around here. I didn't think about actually putting lights in here. Um, what have we got? That's massive. We got anything a little bit smaller? Something? Yeah, that's more like it. I think. Yeah, it's probably the, it's probably the the job. Did you you put it in the middle or at the side? 
I'd, I'd be inclined to have them in the middle, but I just... I don't think it would work with the way the people would move around the area. So it's really dark. I'd be annoyed if I lived there with these bright lights, but... It's nice to have a park near your home. And this is probably something I would forget to actually do. Because I'm always watching the game during the day. So it's only when you switch to night time do you realise... I mean, look at that, I mean it's pitch black. Horrible. There we go. There's poor people walking through here in the middle of the night. I'm gonna get mugged. What am I saying? This is a lovely city to live in. There's no such horrible crimes going on. There we go. You only really need one on, on the side. Might, might need another one. Oh, a weird graphical glitch there. That looks okay. I'm quite happy. I'm going to have an electric bill going through the roof, but... Probably do with doing some nice kind of grass and... Um, I might put like a like a fence here or just something over and, and put loads of grass and things like that. I, in fact, if I'm going to do that, I'll do it in a time lapse so you don't have to watch me... Um, scratch my head, so to speak. Oh, I've, oh, I've, I've got prop Hanagi still on. We've got trees in the middle of my car park. There we go. Is there any more like that? Possibly. I don't know. I'm, I'm quite, I'm quite happy with how that's looking. Let's, let's switch that back up. There we go. That's not too bad. I'm not a big fan of the default trees. I know this a way of removing those and putting your own trees in. But I don't think it's too bad. We have money. So we have possibilities. We got a bit of an issue with um, the landfill. We've got two and they're almost both full. We've got recycling. I'm going to keep this entire area here as a dumping ground. I might download the mod that takes this purple pollution away because it looks terrible. But I would like, um, as you probably saw some of the, um, the, the, the vehicles earlier on, some props. Um, I might actually set up and make this look a little bit more... Kind of, is they seagulls? Ugh. Actually, don't make a noise like they used to. But yeah, I might actually de decorate the whole area. So, where I can, I will decorate. But I don't want to go crazy with it, because I know what it does to the game. And I just, for the most part, I'd like to play the game as it's intended to be played. What is going on there? That's a weird glitch, isn't it? Don't quite know what's caused that, but... Probably me tinkering around with stuff. But yeah, let me know what you think. I mean, how would you like me to play the game if, if you're still here and not falling asleep? How would you, I mean, I'm guessing you want me to play the game properly, but I'm, I'm trying to go for a little bit of a mix of playing it properly as well as aesthetic stuff. And, and that means at times it's going to be a lot of slow stuff. So, I mean, would you like me to edit that out? Or are you quite happy to listen to my thought process, like what I've been doing today? Um, it does mean slow progress here and there, but, I, you know, I'm, I'm quite happy to do that if, if that's what you like. And I'm, I'm happy to play the game whatever way that you want. So, but you know, a lot of people will say, oh, just just play it however you want. But I am. It doesn't matter whether I do it this way, whether I time lapse. I'm not personally bothered. It's more about how much progress you'd like to see per episode, I think, more than anything else. Anyway, enough of me wittering it on. Sorry this episode didn't come out the other day, but I've been, as you can tell, trying out different things, trying to learn how it all works, so it took a little bit longer than anticipated. But on that note, I'm going to leave this episode right here. Thank you very much for watching, but until next time, as always, take care. <laughs>